Hi, this is Zeus the Sparky here. In today's quick tutorial, we'll be learning about how to download and upload to the uh, Siemens module, um, S1200 as they call it. Okay, so firstly, um, to um, download, double click on device configuration and you got your device here. Uh, first, you have to detect uh, your device to get it on the actual software. Um, to do that, um, I've got another quick tutorial on how that is done. There's a few um, barriers, as I should say, or a few frustrations in actually doing this. And I've actually yeah found a solution to the most common one. Okay, so let's just get back to our ladder diagram here. Uh, main. Okay, so get out of debugging mode. Yes, okay. So just say we want to upload something standard. Okay, this is already uploaded to the system, so... Okay, I'll just create something simple here. So, Q0.0, nice. Okay, so I want to download this to the Siemens um, S1200 module. Okay, so this is the download button here. Okay, do you want to overwrite main block? Okay, main block already has um, a ladder diagram programmed in there, so we're overwriting that. So load configuration, this will take some time. Okay, loading complete, errors, warnings, zero. Okay, so it, as you can see, that's pretty quick. Okay, so let's press play here. Okay, so that's your debugging mode. If you do wanna test out your software, you can go here. Okay, bang. Okay, and you also gotta stop CPU and um, start the CPU here. This isn't really necessary, but if you do stop it and it's in stop mode or programming mode as they call it and you try and download you're gonna come up with uh, this software is not loaded because the online status is up to date okay if I press load okay this is gonna come up start modules after downloading to device you need to tick this and okay finish okay and that's the only difference if it's in stop mode okay so it's in start mode Okay, so to upload to the system is a whole different ball game. Upload from there. Okay, let me just. Okay, so I'm gonna just make something different here. Let's make life interesting. We'll add a latch. Bang bang. I O. Wait. Q O point O. Nice. Okay. So we wanna upload the software that's on there. So. The software on the actual module is different to this as you can see i added the latch press upload okay conflicts during loading overwrite okay so we just want to overwrite the current module we got programmed here and upload from this device okay so we uploaded what we had before but just be very careful about that if you do program something different you're gonna lose it but like okay just in that case um, I'll just show you what to do if you don't want to lose the data that you just made and then you accidentally uploaded it would actually be a good practice actually if you get used to doing it okay so here here bang 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 and Q0.0 create this our favorite okay syntax because I put the nice okay and we're gonna okay we're gonna upload again bang okay it's gonna come up with the same thing okay insert with a different name okay so see how we got main one here and we got main this is the one that we just programmed recently and this is the one we just uploaded from the machine so it would actually be good practice to do that so you don't accident if you did work like 30 minutes on something and you want to upload from the machine to see what actually downloaded uh, from there it's actually good practice to download it onto a different block altogether so you don't accidentally override your hard work this is Zeus the Sparky any comments please comment them below or please feel free to um, email me directly on Zeus the Sparky at gmail.com um, you know, do the subscribe if you want to see more tutorials like this and I uh, hope to see you again soon. Thank you